So the next topic under our discussion is law of octaves. This law of octaves was actually proposed by it was proposed by John Newland. John Newland. He has taken some set of he has taken some group of elements from a given period. For example, if you take second period elements like uh, lithium, um, beryllium, boron, carbon, nitrogen, oxygen, chlorine and neon. And again, all these elements they belong to the second period. Second period elements. Uh, this is the first element, second element, third, fourth, fifth, sixth and seventh. Noble gas is an exception. We don't take the noble gas elements into consideration in the case of the law of octets. Then uh, the next element, sodium, is taken as the eighth element. So that means the eighth element starting from the first, second period, and this is the third period. In third period, the starting element is sodium, and uh, the next element is of course magnesium, mm, aluminium, silicon, phosphorus. Sulfur, chlorine, and argon is an exception. So, if you take this set of elements, you find that eighth element starting from the first lithium is the first element, lithium is the first element, and uh, eighth element is eighth element is sodium, eighth element is sodium, eighth element starting from the first element is always is always in octave is always in octave of music which uh, resembles it shows similarity similarity in properties This is called law of octaves and this is law of octaves is applicable only for second and third period elements but it is not applicable for the remaining elements. Our, no, our next discussion is the Mendeleev's periodic table that is Mendeleev here periodic property. periodic property periodic property of elements if you take if you take the periodic properties of elements it is based on the atomic weights as already i have discussed the definition of the mendeleev's periodic table all the physical and chemical properties of the elements are the periodic functions of their atomic weights so here <coughs> if you go for the Mendeleev's periodic table. Mendeleev's periodic table is also called as short form of short form of periodic table, in which uh, it is made up of uh, Mendeleev's periodic table is made up of eight groups, eight groups and uh, six periods. In his periodic table, Mendeleev's periodic table, Mendeleev could successfully give the subclassification. It used to have Sub subgroups, eight main groups. In that eight main groups, subgroups were also there. If you take subgroups, these subgroups were labeled as the 1A group, 1A group, and 1B group. For example, in the short form of the periodic table uh, of the Mendeleev's periodic table, one if you go for 1A group, uh, you can take lithium, sodium, and potassium, lithium, sodium, potassium. For 1B group, copper, silver, copper, um, silver. If you go for uh, 1B group of the Mendeleev's periodic table, 1B group contains copper, silver, and gold. Here, the atomic number of lithium in 1A group is 3, sodium 11, potassium 19, 19, lithium 3, sodium 11, copper 29, silver. 47 and gold it is 79 is the atomic number likewise if you take another set if you can take another set of the subgroups 
similarly subgroups subgroups if you take that is 2b 2a and 2b if you take beryllium magnesium and calcium in 2b we have zinc cadmium and mercury like this he could give successfully the classification for the subgroups of elements in the periodic table and uh, the similarities in the middle east periodic table if you go for the similarities okay similarities similar properties of elements in groups is due to similar valences as i said because of the similar valency if you take for example in 1a group in 1a group if you take lithium lithium monoxide lithium monoxide sodium monoxide and uh, that is potassium oxide so the valency of lithium here the valency of lithium is 1 lithium valency is 1 and oxygen valency is 2 similarly sodium valency is 1 oxygen valency is 2 again sodium va potassium valency is 1 and oxygen valency is 2 so you from this data it is very clear that the that is metals sodium potassium and na sodium potassium comma sodium that is lithium sodium potassium have the valencies of 1 and uh, oxygen oxygen O has a valence equal to 2. Likewise, if you go for second A group, if you take that is beryllium oxide, magnesium oxide, and uh, calcium oxide, if you take beryllium valency is 2, magnesium valency is 2, and calcium valency is 2, oxygen valency, oxygen O valency is again equal to 2. So, from this, it is very clearly understood that. The valency in beryllium, magnesium and calcium is same with respect to oxygen. The next part of the discussion is Mendeleev was successful in placing placing a position, placing an element, element, placing an element in periodic table by giving missing spaces. These missing spaces are nothing but missing elements or rather we can say these missing elements which are given missing spaces they are discovered lately that is why they were given they were given a latin name ekha ekha element the word ekha means the first element in language in the sanskrit language ekha is ekha means one the undiscovered element with certain gap if there is a delay in the discovery of that element that unknown elements were predicted in the form of missing elements and these missing elements were prefixed with ekha elements for example example he has given ekha boron before discovery ekha boron was before discovery the boron the element was named as ekha boron after discovery this ekha boron has become scandium the predicted element was scandium then eka aluminium the element was given eka aluminium as the before discovery element missing element was eka aluminium after the discovery it has become gallium similarly eka eka silicon before discovery the element was eka silicon after the discovery the element has become germanium so scandium symbol is sc scandium symbol is sc gallium symbol is ga and germanium symbol is ge so these elements after the discovery which were predicted before the discovery of the elements the prediction was so apt so perfect that the mendelium that the mendelium could good could give the approximate position for all the elements in their in their respective places in the periodic table that means scandium gallium and germanium were given 
as is expected in that positions of the periodic table in the form of eka boron, eka aluminum and eka silicon. So, the next part of the discussion here you can see that is correction of atomic weights. To give proper position of the elements in the periodic table, Mendeleev could successfully adopt one method of using the formula that is atomic weight, atomic weight of any element is actually equal to the equivalent weight into valency. So, using this formula, using this formula Mendeleev could successfully correct the atomic weights experimentally and it could give the proper position for that element in the respective group such that that element resembles its properties with respect to the subsequent, ele subsequent elements of the same group. For example, if you take let us give one supportive example or supportive illustration for this formula which I gave you for the correction of correct atomic weight for a given element. So, here what is happening you take beryllium we knew that beryllium atomic weight is 9 and atomic number of beryllium is 4. But actually if you take the atomic weight atomic weight of beryllium is equal to let the equivalent weight of beryllium be equal to 4.5 and the valency of beryllium is 2. Why the valency of beryllium is 2? It is supported by the fact that beryllium because it contains 2 valence electrons it can re readily lose 2 electrons and it can form it can give 2 units of 2 units of positive charge because beryllium is able to carry 2 units of positive charge because beryllium is able to give 2 units of positive charge its valency is 2 valency can be understood in terms of the nuclear positive charge or nuclear negative charge so that's why we can say the valency of beryllium is 2 2 multiplied with 4.5 which is equal to 9.0 9.0 means it is automatically understood that this beryllium because of its atomic weight is 9.0 it is placed along with magnesium whose atomic weight is 24.0 and calcium whose atomic weight is 40.0 all these three elements belong to the same group that is secondary group. So, therefore, beryllium with atomic weight 9 is resembling its properties with the magnesium and calcium present in the same group that is alkaline earth metals that is alkaline earth metals alkaline alkaline earth metals earth metals. 